He also called out state regulations, which he says only serve to make local businesses less competitive. You know, listening to you know what they're seeing on the front lines, these conversations are really important to me because it, it helps me take their perspective, this perspective of our community, back to Washington. Yesterday's conversations included concerns about energy, overregulation, and staffing shortages. The congressman said he'll bring local concerns with him back to Washington. Langworthy then took time during National Nurses Week to speak with six floors of nurses at Arna Ogden Hospital. During the visit, New York's 23rd District reps spoke to nurses and learned about their dedication to their individualized specialties. The tour included the neonatal unit, outpatient surgery, the emergency department, and a special in-person thank you to the staff after a three-year-long pandemic. But it's also the kickoff for National Nurses Week. So we went through the facility, saw every department, but also got to show appreciation and thank our nurses that are on the front lines every single day. They've been through an awful lot uh, these last few years. The congressman made it a point to speak to nurses in multiple departments to learn about their work. At the end of the tour, Langworthy presented a proclamation to show his gratitude. And to cap off his visit to the region, Langworthy also went to Watkins Glen. The congressman met with a group of small business owners from across Schuyler County at Horseheads Brewing on Seneca Lake. He says he wanted to visit locally owned places across the southern tier because National Small Business Week was last week. He took questions about federal energy policies, the national debt limit, and the challenges of finding workers in a tough labor environment.